Hey y'all, it's your girl Lala. Welcome back to my channel. So guys, today as you can see, I have this beautiful spread of tropical fruits in front of me. Now guys, I'm going to go in and just let you know what they are. Now over here, we have the beautiful sweet sops, aka sugar apples, which I grow in my garden. These right here are kneesberry. Yes, guys, they have kneesberry growing in South Florida. Here we have some avocados. Yes, guys, avocados are grown here in South Florida. And these are the star fruits. I'm sure there's another name for them, but these are star fruits that my neighbor grow in her garden. Last, but certainly not least, these right here, guys, these are soursops. Yes, guys, if you do your Google research, the soursop has so many health benefits. Very good for your body, okay? And I got these from one of my sister-in-laws that were gifted from another friend who has direct access to them. And here are the soursop leaves. Now, these soursop leaves are very good. They can be stored once dried. They can be stored for years in your pantry, okay? Just put them in a bag or some kind of container and they will last for years. They're very good, full of health benefits to make tea that you can drink. And guys, growing up, living with my uncle, I love to drink soursop leaf tea. We had a huge tree in our yard and I, we were always making soursop leaf tea. Now, the star fruits, of course, I'm going to use those to make drink, as well as you can just eat them just the way they are. And I'm going to try again. I've tried before. I'm going to save the seeds and hope to plant them in my garden. Hopefully, they will grow because they're very prolific and you will get so many of them that you have to give away. Okay. Now, the avocado. I do have an avocado tree in my yard, but it's very small. It's coming. So, I'll give it another, I would say three, four years before I can start harvesting avocados from my garden. The kneesberry, I do have some seeds from about two weeks now. I've not attempted to plant them yet, but I might be planting the kneesberry seeds just to see, you know, if they're going to come and get them into my garden. And of course, I have already two plants of sweet stops in my garden. So guys, this is just to show you living in South Florida is definitely a plus because if you're from the Caribbean and like myself, you're not going to miss home so much because you still have access to beautiful tropical fruits that are grown right here in South Florida. So guys, if you did enjoy this video, go ahead, give me a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please consider to hit that red subscribe button. Because if you now watch your girl Lala, tell me where you do. And to all my friends and families for always coming and watching. Thank you so much. I appreciate each and every one of you. It's your girl Lala. Guys, I'm going to go because I've been meaning to have one of these knees berry. It is ready. They're ready. Yay, guys. See, my finger can dent in. They're ready to be eaten. Once they're soft, they're ready to be eaten. Also, guys, this right here, the sour sop, this one is ready to be used. I'm going to use it to make a beautiful sour sop drink. The avocados, too, are ready. Yes, guys, can you see my dent on the avocado? They're ready. And like I said, I'm going to use those to make some drink. Guys, I went ahead and cut the fruits open so that you can see what they look like on the inside. So here is a sour sop. This is how it looks on the inside very white and creamy and sweet and you can use this to make a beautiful drink okay here we have our avocado most of you are familiar with how avocados look and here are the knees berries this is how the knees berry look on the inside and here's the star fruit So I did not open the sweet sops because the sweet sops were not ready. They're still hard. See, they're still hard. They're not ready yet. And I do have a video on my channel that shows you how the sweet sop looks on the inside. So you can check that out if you want to. 
Okay, so just wanted to show you guys what the fruits look like on the inside. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, it's your girl Lala. Bye.